My name is Andrew Fast. I've been with La Sportiva for about 10 years. All of the apparel that I wear in the mountains is La Sportiva, and, and it just, it's designed by climbers and mountain runners, and so it fits my passions quite well. Span is really darn good of the shoes that I use, but I go through a fair, fair few bit of shoes with the stuff that I like to do. And I will say, uh, there's a lot of sharp rocks in the Wasatch, so that doesn't help the longevity of the shoes that I use. <laughs> there's a lot of things that I like about the Ultra Raptor 2. Starting at the heel cup, this stabilization method that they have in the heel, they've leaned out. Um, so your heel can really sit in the heel cup quite nice and it's well stabilized. Um, and then it also has this bite system on the, uh, near the post in the mid shoe. And so going down trail or for support through the arch of the foot for long days on your feet. And I would say with the wider toe box, um, but I think this shoe is well suited for long days on your feet because it's well cushioned um, with a very good rock plate, good traction. So it's kind of a Swiss army knife as far as the type of dirt that you could be on, buffed out trails or something muddy. It's gonna do well in all those environments. And again, this post is really good to help get some traction going downhill. The toe is super protected. Um, and it's again, the, the composition of rubber has all the proper ingredients of, of a long day on feet. As far as the rock shield is super bomber, the rubber is sticky. So if you're gonna smear on granite or if you're gonna do a little bit of scrambling, uh, this rubber is, is, is um, gonna be good to go in that department. Um, the last thing I would comment on would be the durability. Of all the shoes that like I'll get wet and then I'll be on sharp rocks and then it'll be bone dry, but I found this upper to be really resilient and durable.